So now we have learned how to vectorize a point feature. Now let's see how to vectorize a uh, line feature or a road network. Okay. Uh, it can be a road network, it can be line features or linear features, it can be reverse, right? So um, uh, anything of that sort which is in linear uh, element as such, right? So again, we'll go here, we'll click on uh, start editing, right? Continue. Right, then go to create feature this time you select road network right and then select on line right now one thing uh, while vectorizing right uh, ensure that uh, you enlarge as much as possible so what we are going to do is we will uh, uh, vectorize this particular road right so, so this starting from uh, this particular junction and it is going up to the boundary here right so let's uh, vectorize that and see so enlarge as much as possible so that you can clearly see the uh, center part of it or the thick line uh, as such right then it will be easier for you to draw through the center right so, so your uh, editor is on right you need to click on this road then line road network and line then start with one click at the junction then move forward right ensure that uh, look this is another road junction so, and so here you have to give a node okay. then proceed now to move the map you can use the arrow keys So I have used the up arrow key. Now there is another way also to do it but you should be very careful. So here I am clicking on pan and then moving it. Right. But uh, uh, to come back to this you need to go to create uh, create feature tab and then click on line. Right. Then this one will be active again. Right. And keep clicking. Ensure you are able to capture all the bends, right, and go right along the center of the red line here, right, which uh, signifies the road. Do it slowly, otherwise some uh, the you know it depends upon your computer's processing speed. So sometimes it may get hung up. So again there is a junction here. So I am going to put a node there. Right then again browse down. So go to this one. Select line. There is another junction here, so again I am putting a node, still moving further, there is there is a node, no I have put a node here because there is a, a road line probably, so sometimes map need not be clear, we can always check uh, Google Earth and find out, and in here. So I'll end it at this junction. So I'll ensure that there is a I put a node and then move the cursor right right click finish sketch. Right. So my road layer is ready. Now uh, if I want to give uh, so I'll just save this right uh, now. Now I have not given uh, any extra column to add, right? So uh, because this editor is 
as of now on right uh, we cannot create a new field so what we need to do is stop editing first then click on table options add field road underscore name right so there should not be any space in between right and uh, uh, you cannot enter more than 13 characters so road name will be in text so uh, we'll uh, give ok so then I click on start editing right continue and I'll be able to add road name for example uh, this is uh, NH maybe 73 right something just I'm just giving some number right? so it need not be an 73 in reality but, uh, this is for just to explain to you right and again you can give uh, save edit and proceed right save edit and then I'll just closing it right then uh, from here if you want to start another line for example uh, yeah, you are vectorizing from here right to uh, this particular junction right so here so you can we can what we can do is we can enlarge here go there right click on our uh, road network from the fe create feature this one select line and when you go here you will find look it, it is very clearly showing right road network vertex right so you need to Keep the cursor, uh, ensure that um, uh, you know, square is active, right click, snap to vertex. So automatically it gets snapped to the previously vectorized line. And then we can proceed further. Right. And whatever we did earlier, the same way we are going to vectorize right through the middle. Right. You can either use the arrow key or right, the uh, pan right pan uh, tool right so here there is a junction i am putting a node there right purposefully putting a node so that i can uh, so when i am vectorizing later on it will be easier for me right. and uh, I'm going like this here I am ending it so there is a junction here so I am ensuring I am putting a node moving the cursor right click finish sketch right now I can go to the toolbar uh, sorry the attribute table and give for example this is sh maybe 45 right so then I uh, am going here save and then stop editing right so my uh, road network vectorization has also been done so I would like you to do all the roads in the same manner